Hey y'all, it's Costume Jeweler. We are in downtown Dallas, actually in Deep Ellum. We are going into 2nd Street. Y'all know 2nd Street, my favorite store in Dallas, three locations. We're looking for purses for resale on YouTube live sales. They have a lot of clothing in here and everything. It's like a Play-Doh's closet, but on steroids. Hit that notification bell, click all, make sure you don't miss out on my live buy nows. These video uploads, buy nows are usually on Saturdays at 8.30 or 9.00. Unless I have something else going on, subscribe to the channel. Thumbs up for this video. Y'all are going to love this. If you've never seen a 2nd Street video before, take a look at those. They're all over my YouTube channel. And definitely more valuable than new. So they're going to have lots of... Um, high-end authentic wallets and things behind the cases they're gonna have lots of wallets on top of the counters they have lots of cl lots of clothing too but I don't ever look at the clothing <clears throat> Jimmy Choo look at that one I don't usually look at clothing we look at the jewelry and purses and knickknacks whatnots do dads and trinkets but in here we're just gonna look at the purses look at these Louis Vuittons uh, I am still kind of wanting me a Louis Vuitton wallet at some point. Don't ask me why they play loud music. I have no idea. Todd's, look at that one. That's pretty. Lord, I don't know what that is, but... What is this one right here? Vivian Westwood. You're going to see here they're going to have some jewelry also. I don't know that it's always... I don't really look at the jewelry in here. Y'all know I sell jewelry in my channel. See a big case over there. There's lots of authentic everything in there and they are authenticated they come with an authentic authenticity certificate just make sure if it's not in the purse you ask them for it at the counter because they will give you one so these could be a mixture of men's and women's wallets gucci right there at the back Here's a cool fact right here. You see this Valentino? This one right here, I have it. I have that one. I already have it. I have not put it up for sale yet. Lots of clothing over there, everywhere in purses. We're gonna look at the purses now. What is this one? So now we're going to go through all the purses on the top rack. So y'all get ready and hang on to your seat because there's no telling what we're going to find. Sometimes we don't find anything, but it's fun looking regardless. This one's Todd's. Rose, never heard of that brand. Ooh, look at that Wrangler. So I've never had a Wrangler purse before. That's pretty cool. Probably all leather. Porter is a good brand. Tommy 
Hill figure. Paul Smith is too. What is this beauty right here? Wow. Have y'all ever heard of this? This one here is Rodo, R-O-D-O. -O. This one's called Redwall, never heard of that before. Swimming leather. Croc print looking, but no brand on it. Michael Kors. Pretty nice. What is this one here? Another Michael Kors. Coach, look at these shoes. Doonies, then you have rows of clothing, one after the other. See what I'm talking about? Look at that. What is this light blue one here? Light blue one's Tommy Hilfiger. I don't do Tommy Hilfiger. Why do I not do Tommy Hilfiger? Because I don't. Reminds me of the 90s. I'm just, I mean, 90s were fine. Don't get me wrong. Now look at this Michael Kors right here. Look at that crossbody, y'all. Very nice, very nice. What is this one here? Oh, that's bubbled, that's what that is. I would not have even put that out. And I'm not being negative, I'm just saying I would not have purchased that and I would not have put it on the racks. This looks like a fossil. And it is, look at that part of thing. What do you think about that fossil? It's a good looking one, isn't it? What is this right here? Man, see what I'm talking about? And look at this. I don't even know. I'd be having to have a talk with somebody about that one. That's just not gonna work. That one is not going to work, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think it's a lack of inventory. Look at that beautiful coach, teal color. Nine West, and then look at these shoes. Michael Kors, let me just whisper that ASMR. Purses, Michael Kors, the costume jeweler. Oh my God, look at that one. And y'all have seen my beautiful bracelet. I think I'm gonna have to keep it. I know I keep saying that 21 karat gold. I paid $5 for it. But I think I'm going to have to keep it. I just can't get rid of it. Have you heard of this brand before? Look at that. We want something unusual, ladies. We want something unusual. The older I get, the pickier I get. The longer my channel's been in play, the pickier I get. We want super unusual and something nobody else has. This is Laura Merkin. M-E-R-K-I-N. Laura Merkin. If you've heard of that one before, comment below and let me know. I bet you've heard of Polo. This beauty. This one's called Castain Birthday Bar. Has that little emblem right there. What y'all think about um, those videos from Round Top Texas? If you haven't watched those Round Top Texas largest antiques fair in Texas videos, go check those out. What is this fancy bag, y'all? Look at this. 
This is kind of cool. What is it? And what are these right here for? And there's your designer label. So this one right here is called Kimmy Jima. Never heard of that before. <clears throat> Bet that one's expensive. What do y'all think? Looks fancy. So what do y'all know about the Kimmy Jima? Let me know. What is this? Now this is different. Here's the brand. Look at this one, y'all. Somebody definitely loves Nice looking duty. Y'all tell me what's in this year. Look at this. Oh wow, hammock. Hey, look at this one, y'all. Good brand right here. Very good brand. Looks like a horseshoe bag. Crossbody. All leather. Rebecca Minkoff. Michael Kors. What is this one? Diesel. Paul Smith. Learned that this looks like Louis Vuitton. Louis Vuitton. All the Louis in the cases up front are authenticated. Look at this Fendi right here, y'all. I'm trying to hug it right now. It's so pretty. I'm just like, give me a hug real quick. So good to meet you for the first time. I can't believe it. Well, at least that certain bag. You know, you gotta be friendly with the bags. You gotta tell them they're pretty. You gotta give them big hugs. Love on them. Now that coach is a good looking coach. Tell them how much they're appreciated, ladies. They'll stay longer with you if you do. Talk to them, just talk to them and tell them you are beautiful. And they'll tell you you're beautiful also. I promise they will. Mine whisper to me all the time. Now what is this one, y'all? Look at this. Now this is a big old toy birch right here. It's a good looking bag. It's great condition too. What do y'all think that one's worth? There's not even any rubs on the bottom. Right there maybe just a tiny bit, but not a big deal. Good lord, you're beautiful. 1925, looks like a Fendi a little bit. Calvin Klein, we don't do no Calvin Klein. We just don't. This right here is numbered, it's uh, 94 of 400, so limited edition. Big fat Celine bag right here, look at that one. Huge tote. More, more, more. Ooh, this one's pretty in red. Crossbody. Oh, hello. Now I've seen the perfume, didn't know they made bags, y'all. What do you think about this one? Had no idea they made the bags. Looks like an old Brahmin. This one's Ron Herman. What is this baby right here? So this is in deep alum location, three locations in Dallas. Look at this beautiful duty right here. This is in great shape. How much is that worth, ladies? How much? You know I like Carl, and Carl likes me. And that looks like Bob. I don't know why. Kiplinger. So 
this Pinky and Diane Theodore and Callum I have been contemplating these pants for a long time look at this Dolce and Gabbana snake skin I think I'd look so hot in those so hot Fauci New York right there Prada at 300 Prada 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 this brand is called Dakota first time I've ever seen that never seen it before Henry Bendel we love Henry Bendel you ever seen that name that's a synon that's synonymous with luxury pack it up if you love it ladies pack it up if you love it this is big old bag Oh, little bucket here. Oh, look at you, little fancy thing. Proenza Schuler. I just love the way this looks. Look at this copper running right now through it. Braided copper. ADMJ snake skin. Seen lots of pretty bags so far, but nothing that I'm gonna pack up. I love the mount bags. These are always great. Oh wow, look at this one. Great condition on the inside, looks like new. Another Dakota. I like this one a lot. Patricia Nash. Look at that. What is this one here? It's kind of a cool bag. Black and red. Some more right there too. Oh, now that's cool. Look at this. Looks like a kitty cat. There's the brand for the kitty cat purse. Um, no. Now y'all look at this. DHL is actually a delivery service. No. No, that should not be in here for sale. I don't care. It shouldn't. This one's called Danielle Nicole. Oh wow, I love this one y'all, look at this. Now somebody made this for sure, look at that duct tape on it, just paint it all up. Graffiti purse but handmade, I think. Christian LaCroix. Golden B. Mikowski right there. What is this one here? All hearts. You know I love my snake skin, whether it's faux or not. <laughs> Spade. What is this right here? This little kitty right here is Mason Vincent. Y'all know that I am a sucker for the 
cheetah print. Just like these boots too, I tried them on, but they just did not fit. I'll tell you what, I mean, I tried, ladies, I tried. It did not work, but I thought, meow to me. Meow to me. Yes. If I could get those on, I am telling you, I would rock them. good brand new fossil still has the tags on it looking like a little bit of fall but we in the spring now so we're gonna have to back put that hold on what's this this one right here is just marked vintage look at this y'all Cannot tell what it says on the tag though. Something failed. This is very nice too. Laura Ashley, we've talked about that one before. Not that particular one, that brand. We're gonna look at the wallets now and on to the next store. So again, if y'all have come in here for the first time, I'm the costume jeweler I thrift for purses, jewelry, knickknacks, whatnots, do dads, trinkets, a lot. Philip Lim. We kind of dig through these a little bit just to see if there's a hidden treasure. I saw the purse a few minutes ago. What is this one in the back? Ooh. Tell you what, I wore myself out down at Round Top. What's this? Visconti, this is a little itty bitty wallet. Paul Smith again, so I guess that's it, ladies and gentlemen. We are getting out of here. Come to them live sales, you'll love them. We have lots of beautiful jewelry. Brought a lot of stuff with me to Texas that I'm going to show you. And I also picked up tons of perfume bottles at Round Top, Texas. So until next video, thank you for watching. We'll see you later. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye.